we live in a strange world, actually. We live in a world at present where, based on crowdfunding, for instance, people start inventing game consoles. And somebody put it on Kickstarter and raised $8.7 million dollars and sold 65,000 units within 30 days. That's a crazy world. And one of the other things is that when we design research, a lot has been done not with patients at the table, actually. And it's a bit like blindfolded car racing backwards, maybe not in the Formula One, but you hit something. And that's one of the things that I would like to address to you. This is the slide about research, but these are the guys and girls that are making this research. Money finds researchers, researchers finds money. And a lot of the times, patients are incorporated, as we say, and we ask them. But a recent study from Amsterdam showed that only 3% of all the information and the input that patients have given ended it up in the original design of the research. So what's good is that? We have to change that, I think. So one plus one might be one. For us, it's MedCrowd Fund. It's a nonprofit that we as Radboud University set up and try to find and to design by patients research. So we bring together patients in online groups, family, informal care. Tell us, what are your problems? How could we help you on a daily basis? This is not about medical technology. It's not about medication. It's about how to make your everyday life a bit better, a bit easier. And we try to bolt all those ideas into a plan, obviously. And together with, the pa with these patient groups at one end, a scientific board at the other one, and research writers that volunteer, hopefully, to help these patient groups with crafting their own design to make it run and put it on sort of a Kickstarter-like website. And then the fun starts. Patients, family and informal care crafted this design and start bragging about it in online communities, in social media. They tell it is about science. It's about a safety net for me, for instance, as a patient, like, for instance, Parkinson's disease, for people to help them. We call that short ties. Next, we asked, is there any researcher that thinks that he or she is the best researcher to do this research, actually. And we do that with MedCrowd Pitch. MedCrowd Pitch is a place where researchers, based on a video, profile or pitch themselves. What is your speciality? What is your drive? What's your passion? Why are you doing this? And from out this website, the people who crafted the research, who crowdfunded it, will select in the end, the researcher. Somebody might say that's the world on top, and that's the good thing, maybe. So one plus one, hopefully, is MedCrowd Fund. And from that, we get stuff like this. If you now go to MedCrowd Fund, you can see some of the projects already. And we would like to ask you, you've been here for free today, which is done by the great sponsors for, um, of our event. But maybe you can find on this website one of the initiatives for, being, for research to be done that you could fund with only one dollar or one euro or brag about it, you can help patients with it. Thank you.